So all too soon, phase one is over. I am really, really excited about how it's gone so far. The interns have proven to me that they have what it takes to do teamwork and good planning. I'm really, really impressed by their enthusiasm to learn and try out new things and work together hand in hand to come up with very good and great results. The fundamental reason or the introduction of phase one, the essence of phase one was to get these individuals to understand the basics of content creation, strategic planning, and they tremendously and flawlessly did it together. I'm really proud of what they've done so far in the first place. Anytime I get up, I look at what they've done, ah, I'm just filled with pride. I really, really like what they've done. And now we are going to introduce the second phase. I challenged them to come up with solution that will positively impact a creative society. Identifying individual strengths within their prospective teams helped with the teamwork because there were people who were very good at planning, there were people who were very good at ideating, there were people who were very good at content creation, people who were good at videography. All of them actually had the chance to identify their strengths and work with their strengths to come up with something great. So group A came up with an idea which was to tackle the misconceptions in the creative industry and the channel they decided to use was a podcast show. The ideas that were springing up from the brainstorm were just marvelous. The the name that came up was Reality Check, just to get in check with reality. So these individuals scrutinized the whole creative industry within Ghana and came up with selected people that they wanted to have a conversation with to engage them to let us know about their journey, what their challenges have been, any advice for upcoming young creators. And the process was really nice. We built a whole set in the back of our studio where we painted ourselves did everything ourselves. There was no external forces involved and everything was just splendid. I liked how everybody was hands-on. So Group B's project was a docu-series one. This required that we move all the way to Adan. They had a plan to interact and document by means of photo and video, create content within this bracket. And at the long run, hold an exhibition that will let people be enlightened on the lifestyle of the people in Adan, specifically an island. You'll get to know the name of the island when you watch the docu-series. And it was a wonderful time from the trip to arrival, to the recce, to the planning, to the shooting. I saw an exhibition of teamwork like I always see. So from the videographers, the photographers, everybody had a chance to shoot the best way to light. you see some of the footages where I'll be in the water, shooting with them, letting them understand the key components and the key essential things that come when you are lighting, especially outdoor. It was a really fun time. I loved it. And the essence of the whole project was achieved. So season two is coming up and make sure you share to any creative that you are very positive that will benefit from this intention program. Follow and stay tuned anticipate to the content that is definitely going to come out because whatever it is that is going to come out from these star creators is going to blow your mind because i've seen what they've done and it's crazy it's mad try your best to share with any creative or anybody who is within and without the creative space who wants to embark on something creative content creation make sure you also follow our instagram facebook twitter youtube and tiktok pages wherever you type star creators africa we will definitely pop up and always send us a dm if you have any inquiries any questions you can always send us a dm and give us a follow at star creators africa 